have the Wi-Fi password ready just in case. And the announcement will be made in Mandarin. Hi everyone, welcome to House to Smart. Today we finally get to do some actual smart home setting up. Our chosen device today is the Mi Control Hub. I have here with me the Xiaomi Gateway version 2, specifically the Chinese version which only connects to the Chinese server. The reason why I am using this is because I need these to connect to the Akara wall switches and if you buy the international version, you will not be able to add the switches to the hub. So let's get on to connecting this baby up. First, make sure that the Mi Home app is installed on your phone. You can download it from the App Store or Google Play Store. Ensure that you are connected to a 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi network. And lastly, have the Wi-Fi password ready just in case. Once installed, launch the app. You will need an account. Create one if you haven't already done so. Select your local region and choose to either use an email address or mobile number. Enter your password and capture and hit submit. Activate your account before heading back into the app again. Don't worry about the region because we can change this later. If you are signing in for the first time, you may notice an empty space at the top left corner that usually houses the name of your home. To you give your home a name, we go to the profile and scroll down to settings and tap on manage home. Tap on the name of your current home, which is usually named after your account number, and then set your home name and tap save. Wait for the confirmation to pop up and you're done. Next, double check that you are on the Chinese server by scrolling down to region in the settings menu. If you're not, simply tap on region and switch to the Chinese mainland server. Now we are ready to add your very first home automation device. From here, you can either tap on add device or the plus button at the top right corner as shown. Tap on the search bar to search for me control hub. Wait for the screen to load and follow the on-screen instructions. This step involves resetting the device, usually by long pressing a button on the device. In this case, press and hold the top button for 5 seconds. The light will start to blink in yellow and the announcement will be made in Mandarin. Once you hear that, tap on Operation Complete on your phone and tap Next. Your Wi-Fi network and password should be automatically populated. If not, simply key in the access ID and network name or the password. Next, you need to switch to your phone settings and join the Wi-Fi network that is shown on the app. Head back to the app after the connection is successful and the next steps are pretty much straightforward and idiot proof. You select the room, you rename the device if you wish and add any friends or family members to your home. And that's it! Congratulations on your first step to creating a smart home. In our next episode, we cover how to add child devices and also how to create home automation sequences. If you've got any questions or have a specific video request, please drop us a note. Meanwhile, remember to follow and subscribe. See you next time. Bye!